kwamba wakati hata uh, mama ni mjamzito uh, ni vyema uh, vitu ambao anapitia ni vitu ya kufurahisha inafaa pia kuwa na akina baba karibu uh, na ye, ili nayo mtoto aanze kuwazoea mapema na tumegundua kwamba masingara ambao o, watoto wetu wanaelewa ni masingara sa singine ambao itakuja kuambukiza uh, mambo ambapo uh, watakuwa wakiiga wakiwa wakubwa kama mtoto amelelewa mahali ambapo watu wanafurugana basi huyu mtoto atakuwa mtu ambao uh, kwa siku za uzoni atakuwa mtoto ambao all the time anakuwa intimidated very aggressive uh, anapenda vita resources are actually human are the biggest human capital that we are investing in and that is the reason why we have taken leadership in trying to ensure that we cover the first six counties but our goal is to cover the entire 14 counties once you bring up children who are well developed then you really hit at the rock of the economy of the block because you are coming up with uh, children who will be useful in the next generation and we know that they will create wealth for this block. You can only expect that if you deal with their nurturing at the, at the earliest opportunity. Nurturing care should be a national priority uh, in this country, in the county, uh, because these are some of the things that if we don't do, the emotional development, physical de development, social and everything else, affects children because at those early years, the zero to three, where we do not sometimes really think that they need uh, some care. Tuko na mashida nyingi kakameka county vile mnajua, teenage pregnancies zimeenda juu, na ukiona teenage pregnancies zimeenda juu as parents ama kama wazazi, there's something we have missed kufanya. Hawa ni watoto ambao, Wanaza wengine. And we are saying right now, ukienda neighborhood, so I'm, I'm a maternity, utapata watoto wa 10 to 19 years. So, tunapoongea maneno ya nature and care, tunataka eh, watoto wetu haswa kakamega ama the lake economic region, kini siku hizi, parents, sometimes mtoto anapoza, mtoto ameza mtoto. Already, to some families, that is a disgrace. Wazazi wanaona ameo let down, ameo wacha school fees, shuleni. So, hawa watoto wako hapo, hakuna mtu ana, anafanya hiyo nurturing care, that responsive care. So, huyo mtoto hako tu at a certain corner, because maybe the, the mother has gone back to school. You want to tell me a grandmother has time ya kuchesa na mtoto kama huyo. Already hako bita kwa nini hii huyo alizaliwa. This is an added uh, burden kwa hii family. Much happens in our families, even our own relatives. Wana rape, wana rape or defile our watoto, wana washikisha mimba, alafu mtoto anakuwa hapo, hata akirudi shule. Hujelewi, so ni burden ya kulea hui mtoto, hakuli vizuri, she's anemic, hawezi breastfeed hui mtoto, mtoto hawe healthy, hawezi kuongelesha mtoto wake because hana time.